Hi, good day. Welcome to my blog. This is Captain Bjorn Fernandez. And for today's blog, I'm going to teach you on how to send a DSC test message using the MFHF unit. Okay, by the way, this is the MFHF. This is my Inmarsat C number one. This is my Inmarsat C number two. And we have the Fleet Broadband and of course the printers of those. Okay, I don't have an NBDP because if you are equipped with two in Marsat C, that means you are not required to carry a, a narrowband direct printing text. Okay, so ladies and gentlemen, this is for Uno. Okay, control unit type FS 2575C. It is already will mark. Okay, serial numbers are there. And this is my MFHF so basically I'm just going to show you this is the volume or the power button if you if you uh, move it counterclockwise it will be switched off okay now switch on once again okay. then your monitor will appear in just few seconds all right initializing There you go, it's up and running right now. And this is the gain knob, okay? You have to push to attenuate, okay, meaning to increase. And the alarm indicators, if it's indicated there's alarm, then you should acknowledge. And this is the undesignated distress button, okay? Undesignated. This is the button for the designated, meaning you, can, you, have, you still have time to compose a distress message. And uh, other DSM message that will be the DSC test, okay, which I will teach you right now. Of course, the brilliance, and we have the numerical keys scan the this uh, auto frequency to 182 kilohertz, receive transmit channel, okay, the tuning, and uh, we have the enter button, okay, and of course, the menu, the tab, and uh, silencing the alarm and of course cancel okay going back on the monitor so let's start okay and for today I'm go I want I am in Bera Mozambique so it's nearby nearest DSC station MFHF is the Cape Town okay I have read it here a list of uh, stations that normally replies okay so First thing to do is to click other DSC message. Okay? And this window will appear. It shows compose message. So it's not an it can be an individual individual message and the priority can either be routine, safety, uh, urgency or distress. So let's change this enter. Press enter here. And scroll down to test message okay then press enter all right and then for the address number you have to input the maritime mobile service identity so press enter once again and direct input okay so you can either send it to a ship station or a coast station okay so I said before we're going to send it to Cape Town. So Cape Town, it is 0060100001. Okay. 0060100001. And 1. Okay. So all coast stations always starts their MMSI with two zeros. Okay. Remember that. So press enter and priority is safety it's a safety test message and DSC frequency is we're going to increase it so press enter to select which frequency and there you go those are the default DSC frequencies okay it's daylight right now so we can choose either 16804 or 12577 kilohertz okay so we'll use 12577 kilohertz and then with that 
we press enter okay now we have completed drafting our message then it's highlighted go to call okay then press enter okay sending test message to 0060130001 and there's the elapsed time the information is here meaning it's already sent and later on once it's sent and acknowledged we can print it out so we can scroll here and print okay so we wait for a little while until Coast Station Cape Town acknowledges back and then we can record it to our GMDSS record book and also with our planned maintenance system or the PMS If it doesn't reply in probably two minutes, we can scroll this, okay, and resend, okay, for him to acknowledge. You can see there, telex, transmit frequency, it's 12577, receive frequency, it's 12577. It will always be the same, okay? The DSC frequencies will always be the same. So we can print for now. Okay. There you go. All right. Acknowledge request. Okay. Now we're waiting for the acknowledgement. Okay, it's already two minutes. You can see there, two minutes, two seconds. Now we can reset and press. Okay, resending test message to the same co-station. Now, if this station doesn't reply, you can try other nearby co-stations uh, until you get such an acknowledgement. Because uh, normally, this is always uh, seen or verified by the vetting inspectors, safety inspectors, or third-party personnel. Okay, and they want to see your records they want to see your GMDS record book and of course in in conformance with your plan maintenance system as well now while waiting let me show you what's inside the the menu okay so let's click menu all right so for the menu there you go we have different uh, numerical tabs one is test two is user channel okay and three is log okay if you press log it will show you the receive distress the general okay and the transmit message okay back to menu again we have the system, okay, system frequency, key assign, print, position, set up. So it is already, this is already set up with the GPS. The date and time is always uh, set to UTC or coordinated universal time. Okay, other than that, uh, DSC, uh, you can record your co-stations, address book, or even ship station, message file, acknowledgement settings. Special message, routine scan, and other distress scans. For audio, okay, key click meaning it's the volume. Off hook, it's already mute, set to mute. Alarm distance, it's 500 nautical miles. And for the alarm, you can see here the alarm log, okay. Uh, it's all, it, all, all, everything is acknowledged. So go back to menu for a cancel. And then you have also the service. If you press service, okay that is used for the engineers okay now we go back to our message okay there you go just press cancel nothing has happened we press or resend the 
one again once again all right and we can also change the the transmit channel or frequency so info go back to my info or press cancel okay we can create another another uh, message you finish this sequence yes all right now that uh, message is already cancelled so we press go back to the other uh, same procedure as before press other DSM message go to message type select test message Direct input zero zero six zero one or zero one. Okay. And we can select the highest channel for now. And then press go to call. Okay. And print. Alright. Now we've sent uh, via one six eight zero four kilohertz. One six eight zero four point five transmit and receive frequency okay so that's how you do it thank you very much and i hope cape town acknowledges that once again this is captain bjorn please like subscribe and follow my channel or even a like bye